Hey, so first impressions. Excuse the background, not great, but oh well. So I ordered from Topshop and I got some th little things from TK Maxx. So I wanted to do kind of like a first impressions, tell you people what I think about it, type thing. So I'm just gonna get in into it because why not? So first things I'm gonna go for is these shoes. Now it says here that they're 24 pounds. Just some white trainers, which I'll get out to show you. It says that I bought for 24 pounds, but I'm not sure if I actually paid 24 pounds for them. Um, I might have actually, I might have paid £24 for them. How do I find them? Oh my god, really? I don't think this would be this hard. Cookies. Oh, well. Okay, so one pair I paid tenner for, and the other pair I paid the original price for. Does it say what they are? Curly white. They are curly white. And I paid Curly Lace Trainer £24, pounds, so I paid the original price for these. Um, I don't know how they're going to be, they're just literally plain white. I bought plain black and plain white trainers because you can't really go wrong with... I mean they're cute, nothing special, but they're cute. They always smell like really new, don't they? But they're cute, they say Top Shop, chop, bleh, top shop on these. Really cute, £24, pounds, size 3. Yeah, they're cute. I might do little snippets of me wearing stuff, I might not, I might do, but I like these, um, they're just like, yeah, got them, like a texture to them all, all the way around, I think they're really cute, for plain trainers you can't really go wrong can you, can't go wrong, I've seen worse, oh and they also say, say Topshop on the black, black on the back in gold, which is cute, I love gold so, oh, I wouldn't even say they're gold, more like a fake rose gold, um, and then the next pair of trainers that I got, which these would be £10, because one I paid £10 for, but these were originally £24 as well. Um, if I can open it, probably not. Oh, is that, for some reason it's been sellotaped, I don't know why, maybe they've been re-sent back, probably, yeah. Yeah, probably sent back. Um, so yeah, again, same kind of thing, but these are just plain black, there's no texture on them. They've got little stars on the bottom. Top shop there, no top shop on the back, top shop in there, but that doesn't really matter. But yeah, just again, plain, these are a tenner on offer. Can't really go wrong again, can you? Size three again. And for a tenner, not really like breaking the bank, are you, for ten pound pair of shoes that were so I got fourteen pounds off them, so that's great. Um and then stay there please, stay there please. And then the next item that I got were these High waist ankle grazer Jamie jeans. Um, they're originally £46. I paid. I paid. Stripe Jamie jeans. £20. So £26 off, I think. That makes sense, right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm not very good at math. But, um, so yeah, let's try and open these. I hate the when the packaging rips. That's my worst pet hate. Because it's like, what's the point? What was the point? Yeah, so I hope these fit. I mean, waist, oh, they seem good, seem good. So waist is 25, length 28. And um, they got a little stripe, I love striped as I'm wearing some now that I'll show you. Ta-da! <laughs> these are from H&M though. Um, and they're like leopard print, that is leopard print, yeah. With a little stripe on it, and I think that's really cute. It goes all the way down to the ankle. I like it. They're just some really cute, plain, simple jeans. I mean, they're my size, definitely. Definitely my size. I like tight fitting waist stuff because I've got a really small waist. Um, so hopefully these will be really nice on. And I love them. Look at that. Oh, it's so cute. So cute. I love it. Thought they'd go really cute, especially with either the white or the black shoe trainers. You know what I mean? Can't really go wrong, can you? Can't go wrong. For 20 quid, I was definitely getting them. They are petite also. I like to get a thinking petite if possible. If not, I will go for a size four because I'm so small. Um, it's quite a struggle actually being small. People always like think it's probably better. I don't, well, I don't know. I'm just assuming people would think that and it really isn't because I end up half the time having to buy really expensive clothes. For some reason, the smaller you are, the more expensive they are. Or you have to end up buying kids clothes. And that's not fun when you're walking downtown and then you see a five-year-old in the same jacket as you and you're like, wow. Next up, 
these are on offer i think these are a size four um doesn't say that they're oh no top shop petite they are petite Corey mid-rise easy fit and they were 26 quid um i'll show you what they are in a minute i'll probably do this so backwards but otherwise i'll forget the price so let's do this first um these are a tenner so i got 16 pounds off them which I'm quite happy about um, I love to buy sale items. I'm not really a person that doesn't like sale items. I love sale items. I think it makes sense, doesn't it, buying things in sale. Why would you want to buy things at original price when you could just wait for them to be in sale? The only problem being small is when they go in sale, usually everything's out of stock in my size, so I have to buy, literally I have to buy what's in stock. But this time I was quite surprised with Topshop. They had some cute things that I was impressed with. So these, so these are, uh, oh yeah, just a size four. Um, it doesn't say anything about the waist or anything so see what i mean these are a bit bigger than the jeans but they should be okay hopefully hopefully we'll try them on and we'll see the cutoffs they're quite cute i just thought they were really cute and adorable i don't know if they'll fit me though that's a pain they might do quite big but they might do we'll see we'll see we'll see we'll see so yeah i think i just said they were a tenner didn't i um and they were originally 20 pounds 26 pounds so 16 quid off again can't go wrong happy days love it i love it so all of this that i'm videoing and i'm gonna hopefully pull it up later um it's all on sale and in stock at this moment at this very second i literally ordered these like literally like four, four days ago not even four days ago i'd say four days ago yeah actually four days ago next thing i got is a glamorous yellow tartan top size four um Glamour, oh I don't know if it's glamorous or glam, oh no it's glamorous, um, these seem to be quite a popular thing in Topshop, I don't know why, uh, eh. what's this, glamorous, for petite, it does, it's not telling me the original price, um, which isn't really a problem, but it's basically a cut off, I actually didn't realise but I actually bought two tops in the exact same material, just different things, um, I'll kind of pull it on for you now so you kind of get the gist of what it is. So it's just a little cute tie up. I love things that tie up and I love long sleeves and crops. I don't know why it's so weird and off. Not right, but I just like it. I like weird things. I've always been weird. So it's kind of just like this. And I thought this would be really cute in the right occasion. So yeah, it's cute, right? Just different. I like different kind of gave me like i don't know like clueless vibes but now clueless in 2019 yes so this was tartan tie up blouse 12 pounds i don't know what it was originally i can't tell you but 12 pounds can't go wrong i think it was on offer i think everything i've bought here was on offer because that's just what i do i buy everything on offer for me, on offer is the way forward, and I'm going to put these down here because they're not working with me today. Because I put put them on shoes. But yeah, it doesn't say originally what it was at all. It just says size four everywhere, and it says glamorous.com. So I guess they like Topshop have like collabed with Glamorous. And to be fair, I think Glamorous is Topshop because the reason why I say that is because I've also bought another top. And exactly the same print and it is actually I don't know why they've covered that over but it is actually um, the same print fabric material but different it's Topshop and then this one's Glamorous so I think Glamorous is Topshop and they just sell the clothes on that so yeah like the same as Miss Selfridge Burton, Top Man, Wallace, Topshop all the same people so if you think that you're going to different places and they're different people they're not that's a lie so next thing we got is this Topshop Petite top which I got UK size 6 um, it's 20, 20 pounds 20 pounds and I think this is a return because it's been sellotaped so I'm assuming it's a return when when they're sellotaped because not everything's sellotaped when it's sellotaped I'd say it's a return that's my opinion. I don't know. I don't. I don't work at Topshop or the factory, so. But I've already got a top, a jumper, which is actually over there, um, by Tea and Cake. 
and I like this, I don't know why it's US, USAF. I don't know if it means like United States as fuck or I don't know, but it's only really cute, look at it. I just thought it was really like simple and cute and I like things like this. Um, I'll tell you if I bought it for 20 pounds, I don't think I did. Um, let's find it quickly, quickly. I don't want this to be like an hour long video. Um, United States, I bought it for seven quid, so three pounds off. I mean, it's all right, no, it's just a plain top. I will try these on, and if I don't like anything, I definitely will send it back because I'm very peculiar about what I wear, how I wear it. I have to feel comfortable. If I don't feel comfortable, then I, I won't wear it. I just won't wear it. I've always been like that. I have to feel comfortable. That's my main priority, is feeling comfortable. Now, this is what I was on about. It's the same pattern, exactly the same. There is no different, absolutely no different. Only difference is this is Topshop Petite, that's Glamour Petite, so they must be the same company. Um, and this is a return because it's not fully opened, it's like sellotaped again. So they must like send their, they must just like put their returned in. I don't know if they're returned bags, but no, I don't know. But it's been sellotaped, so it must be a return. Um, oh, it's got a cute little collar thing. But yeah, it's exactly the same, but it's an actual... I think it is a bit crop, I think. Yes, yeah, a bit... a bit... no, no, I lied. I lied, it's not crop. <laughs> I lie all the time. No, I'm joking, I don't really. Um, so yeah, it's just the exact same, but a normal one. And you can wear this open with, like, the USA... They're actually the same mustard colour. Um, with the USA F underneath, you can do all sorts with it. Just a cute little lumberjack plaid shirt, which I love. And I'll definitely keep, 100%. So yeah, stick that in. And then I got this up, which this is Topshop Petite, £32. I don't think I bought that, paid that for that. I don't remember paying £32 for a skirt. Um, um, camo cord skirt. 20 quid, so I've got a tenner off, not too bad, could be worse. Yeah, see what I mean? And then these are sticky. Like it's not, like it's original pack, it's in its original packaging. So I believe all the sellotape ones, I know, all the sellotape ones, stay. All the sellotape ones I believe are a return. Um, so yeah, this is a petite. I don't usually, I can't get away with things like this usually, so I really wanted to give this a go. So, yeah, it's literally, uh, I think it's meant to be like kind of a mini skirt and got a zipper at the front. I mean, originally 32, oh, and a little button, which is good because you don't want the zipper, yeah. So, I don't know, I mean, I wouldn't pay £32 for something like this, definitely not. I don't know why, but I just wouldn't. But I like it, it's got actual real pockets, it's cute. Like right, if I just stand up, wait, quickly, like, you see what I mean? It's cute, it might work, it might not, I don't know, we'll see, we'll see. We'll see. But it's a petite. I am stuff like this. I have to get a petite because if I don't get a petite, it's just not gonna work. Um, I got this and a cute little sports bra, and I reckon that would look really quite cute in a in a um shoot because it's like an Elise sports bra, bra, and it's all like this kind of print underneath. So it might work. It might work. With some cute heels or something, and like a little shirt. I don't know. I don't know. So we got that. Um, we've got three more items left from Topshop and then some TK Maxx items and then we're done. Um, so then the next thing is a pair of jeans. These are Joni Super High Waisted Skinnies, exact same uh, width 25, length 28. These were originally £38. Jeans are expensive at Topshop. Um, yeah, so, oh, I paid £15 for these. Jeez, that's a lot, like, 20, 23 pounds off, like, that's good. 15 pounds for a pair of jeans. I'm not complaining. And I really believe no one else has bought these because they come in, like, like, original packaging with the sticky stuff, so. I think this is a big, like, yeah. So, yeah, let's get them up and have a look. So, oh, I like these. So they got like, oh wow, oh wow, 
So it's like the stripe again, but it's tinsel. It's like tinsel effect and it's like orange and pink. And I really like these. Oh my God. Oh, look how cute they are. They're adorable. I can't wait to put them on. They're so cute. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. I mean, told you the size, told you the price. It's really pretty, if you can see that. Like really tinselly. It's really cute. They have a texture, definitely. Um, and it definitely is tinsel. It's like lines going down tinsel. Um, I love these. These are a big yes. Um, I just, I'll have to try this on for sure because sometimes Joni jeans can make my bum look really flat and I don't like that. Because I already have a flat bum. Like, I have wiggles and stuff, but it's quite flat. It's not like big and curvy like most girls. Well, not most girls, but like girls have. Um, but yeah, I don't have a curvy bum. So when I wear Joni jeans back in the day, I look at photos now and I'm like, there's a non-existent bum. I look like a grasshopper, basically. A grasshopper. Now I've got this. And this, and they're both the exact same thing, different colours, um, and I think different prices too. So, petite brush hoodie. So the pink one, seven pounds, and then this one, ten up. Now they didn't look this fluffy, like this material. Like it's, it reminds me of military material. Um, it's obviously a bit of a military vibe. No, not really. No. Um, but, <laughs> but um. So yeah, I don't know how I'm going to feel about this. Okay, oh okay, it's a lot softer than I thought. Oh wow, that's really soft. I thought it was going to be like really itchy, scratchy, horrible material. That's okay, it's not too bad, it's not too bad. So originally, this was £22. Oh no, 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 no. Oh, it's really nice inside too. It's really like jersey material inside. I would not pay £22 for that, just to let you know. <laughs> Never. It's just cut at the bottom, plain cut. So it's like a crop. I'll show you. I'll show you. I'll put it on. I'll put it on quick. Long arms, love long arms and the crop thing. Oh. oh I'm, a bit, I'm a bit stuck. Oh. Oh, there you go. <laughs> so yeah. So, I mean, it's not the thickest. It's not going to keep you that warm. But it definitely is cool if you're running. Oh, we've only got one string. Oh, there you go. So, I mean, uh, it's not too bad. I mean, it's not not £22 worth, is it? Let's be honest. But it's not too bad. I mean, I mean, it's cute. It's quite snuggly. It's not, it's really thin. The only thick places is there. And the hood, that's really thin. It's like, you can probably see the blue, but yeah, you can see the blue behind it. So let's give it a go with the hood. I hate hoods, so. Yeah, no, I'm not feeling that. I don't like the hood at all. Definitely no hood. Yeah, I won't wear the hood, but I'd wear. Oh, it actually is a pool thing for the hood, so that's quite cool. So, so you could probably like if you're if it was raining and you're running, and you don't want to get too well. You're gonna get bloody wet in this. I'm sorry, <laughs> it's not gonna keep you dry. But yeah, for a seven quid, I won't complain. Twenty two pounds. If you bought this for twenty two pounds, you were ripped off. You were ripped off. I don't think that one's worth a tenner. Now I've put this on, definitely not worth a tenner. Seven pounds, yeah. Tenner? Nah, not worth a tenner. I think in Primark this would be classed as a fiver. <laughs> not gonna lie, like, I can't believe they're trying to tell. Oh, it's one of those... bits everywhere, yeah. Um, I can tell that they've definitely ripped you off, like, I'm sorry, but... It's forty dollars, I wouldn't even pay forty dollars for it. But yeah, it's a size four. So if you're really small and petite, size 4 is going to fit you. Um, I'll get the other one out just so you can see the different contrast colours. Like, I'm one of these people that I struggle. If there's like one thing in loads of colours, which I'm kind of gutted I even bought these. I wish I didn't buy them now. They're a pretty waste of money. Um, but if, they're, if they weren't on sale, I wouldn't have got them because I would have been spending, what, £44 on that. Nah, Topshop, what are you doing? Like, that's really bad. That's a big rip-off. These are definitely no way over a tenner. Like, look, there's just thread coming off it and everything. It's just badly made as well. It's not even nice. Why did I buy these? They look really cute online. They they literally were doing it. They were working it. Look great. It smells funny, too. Um, Yeah, they're, they're freezing cold. You're never going to keep warm in these. But maybe for summer. For summer, I reckon it would be all right if you're running. Yeah, like the hood is the thickest part. Like, look how thick that is. And then look at that. There's nothing. Can you see me through it? Yeah, probably. Oh, I just can't do this. Like, 
Oh, I don't like this. I literally feel like this is army wear. You know, really cheap material. I don't know. <laughs> when they're trying to torture you and they just want you to cold. Because I mean, this one's better than the pink one. Oh, it just doesn't feel right. It just doesn't feel right. I don't like it. It's not for me. Oh, God. £22. Are you kidding me? Top shop, mate. Behave yourself. So, yeah. That's it. I wish I did these first because this is the biggest disappointment I've ever had from Topshop. I mean, it's all fluffy and this one's quite itchy, actually. It's quite itchy. I'm glad the hood isn't itchy, but, yeah, it's, it's not nice. I would, I'd never, I'm not telling you to go and run out and buy this right now. Do not. If you've bought this, go send it back. It's bloody awful. I don't like this at all. I've probably spent too long talking about these products and that I don't like them. But let's go to a better note. Oh, I've got one more thing from Topshop. But let's go on to a better note with TK Maxx. But these, I'm sending these back. I don't like them. Like, I might keep... No, I don't like them. I'm not keeping them. <laughs> don't even kid yourself. I'm not keeping them. <laughs> it's just because it's Topshop. It's like, I want to like them because it's Topshop. Because I love Topshop. But you... Nah, Topshop. That. Don't ever sell these Topshop again. <laughs> don't. Because it's only going to make you look bad. It's already made you look bad. I loved you before I bought these. Yeah, they're awful. Don't ever buy them. I wouldn't recommend. No, 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 no. So they're the last items. Which I do have one from here. So top shop. This was... It's not going to tell me. Um, but how much did I buy it for? Security protected, apparently. <laughs> Great. Um, I don't know, I don't know. Last item from Topshop, it is uh, Fiverr, I think it was originally like a tenner, it's just a chain necklace, it's got lots of chains, I didn't really know what this was at first, um, but then I've bought it and I've realised it's like a ancient sun worship type god thing, if you can see that, it's pretty freaky actually because it's got no face, so that's quite freaky, definitely occultism stuff, but I just like the, the layered chain effect, that was the only thing that caught my eye. Other than that, I'm not impressed. I might even send it back. I mean, is it worth it? Nah. So the hoodies and that, I'll probably send back. I like everything else. I mean, the tie-up glamorous thing's a bit... It's alright. But then I got this in TK Maxx, so we'll end on a good note. This from TK Maxx, it was originally £55, and I got it for £16.99, and it's by Long and & Son. Never heard of it, but I'm guessing it's an American brand, maybe? I'm guessing so, or Europe? American Europe? I don't know. But yeah, it's really cute. It's just got one compartment. Two zips. I don't know why it's got two zips. Maybe so you can put a lock on it or something, I don't know. Um, yeah, it's quite cute. It just, it's still got all its stuff in it, like the package and stuff. But it's really cute. And I thought it would go nice because I got like a pinky salmon colour pink. Well, it's not really salmon, is it? Salmon's brighter like that. But um, like a... a baby beige pink um coat which this actually goes really well with it um it's just really well made too which i like thank you yeah it's just it, it does it it does it for me i liked it there was one that was really nice but it was 20 pounds and i saw this and i was like oh, it's cheaper i love it and i like the, the like fake quilted effect i like that with the studs the studs for me were what what brought me over yes i love studs and then last two items I'm saying two items because I'm like, what did I buy? <laughs> but I remember now. And this is from, if you know any of these makes, because TK Maxx is obviously like a lot of American brands. I don't know any of them, never heard of them, but I know this is American because it says LU Love NYC. So I don't know if it's Lou Love New York City, Love You Love, I don't know, I don't know what it means. But this is a small and it's cropped with long sleeves. Like, look at that, it's so cute. The sleeves are a tiny bit long, but don't bother me because I think it's really cute and adorable. And I love the like American style stripes, like kind of like sporty, and I love that stuff. It's, it's really me. Um, it's a size small, and it was nine. So yeah, this was nine ninety nine. Sorry, I just had to go attend to my thumb. Nine ninety nine, really cute, really cute. Like it literally is just crop, long arms. I love that stuff. I love green. Green's a really good big color for me. Don't know why. I like. I think red, dark blue. 
uh, green. I think all the, like, the boyish colours suit me more. Stripes suit me more. And then my last item that I got, items, I say items because it comes together, but it was items. Um, it was $6.99 for two Elise. I hope that's how you say it. That is how you say it, isn't it? Elise. I'm sure it is. Um, sorry, I'm out of breath because I kind of like, yeah. Extra small, which I love because the smaller the better for me. The smaller the item, the smaller the size, I think. And um, yeah. So that, two little sports bras. Literally just covers the chest area, which is really cute. I love them, pretty, and one in grey, which I thought they were really cute. I love that. I love army. I love army, navy. I like all that stuff. So yeah, that is literally it. That is my haul. That is my haul. So if you wanna see any more hauls, probably not. <laughs> but yeah, I just wanted to share you guys with you guys what I got because why not? I mean, then if you liked any of it, give it a thumbs up. Share this if you wanna. I don't know, you don't even have to, don't even worry, don't even worry about it. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to share with you what I got, because I wanted to see if you guys, you know, you might like some of it, and then you might go, oh, I need to go to Topshop, or I need to go to TK Maxx, because always go, always go to TK Maxx, definitely. Take care, guys. Take care, guys. Bye. <laughs>